racial tensions on social media after a picture showing six white male students standing with their boots on top of an African American male student who's lying face down on the floor at Moody High School. CBS 42 News reporter Corey McGinnis joins us now live in the studio. Corey, you've been talking to parents and students. They're all friends in this picture? Yeah, good evening, Sherry. They are all friends in that photo, and they have been friends for quite some time. I spoke with those students who tell me it was meant to be a joke, and they want the community to stop threatening their families. I'm so sick of the threats and the bull crap. Jennifer Kellum's blood is boiling after her son and his friends took this photo at Moody High School and posted it to social media last week. They really were making fun of racist people. Students were encouraged to participate in Dallas Day, but some of the students took it to the extreme and interpreted it as Redneck Day. The picture shows six white students stepping on one black student who meant it as a joke. I'm thinking about it now, but I didn't think about it when we first took the photos. Nick Fuller is the teen on the floor. I would still like to say sorry again for anybody that I offend, offended. He admits his involvement. It was taken out proportion. And so does Austin Glass, Kellum's son, standing in the maroon shirt. If I could go back, I wouldn't have took the picture. I wouldn't even, probably wouldn't even have dressed up for that day. Moody community members weighed in. It's upsetting, you know, to see that going on in the school system. They are more understanding of what they did wrong, and I think that we should let it go. Never face it to The superintendent released this statement, quote, I understand that all students involved are friends and participated and voluntarily in creating the picture, which they say was intended to be a joke. Obviously, there's nothing funny about the picture. It is offensive and unacceptable, and it does not reflect the values of Moody High School, the St. Clair County school system, or our community. All students involved will be disciplined appropriately, end quote. I couldn't sleep last night. Meantime, Kellum continues to apologize, wants the community to stop with the threats, and hopes this is a lesson learned for those involved. I'm ashamed that they even thought that this was cute or funny. Now, each student received 15 days of alternative school. Live in the studio, Corey McGinnis, CBS 42 News local coverage you can count on.